Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming a swatch party video on a palette that I have been dying to get my hands on. This is the newest palette by Juvia's Place and it's called the Doshe by Juvia's, I believe. My husband is actually from South Africa and he kind of told me how to pronounce it, but that was a while ago and I can't quite remember. So this one is definitely one of those palettes that made me think like, what the heck am I gonna do with that color combination? But uh, when I really looked at it, I was like, man, I could maybe do some really sweet looks with this because essentially it has some colors that I really gravitate towards. And also I'm gonna spoiler alert and say, this is probably what I wish the white chocolate chip palette by Too Faced would have been like. Like, I wish they had tried a little harder with that palette. Anyway, that's here nor there. If you are new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe down below. My goal is to make it to 8,000 subscribers by the end of the year. I need about 150 of you to click that subscribe button, but I do remain optimistic. And if you aren't new to my channel, hi guys. Thank you again for watching my millionth swatch video. You guys know I love to do these because I feel like it gives you kind of a fun, authentic experience. I mean, you should definitely watch reviews, but for me, like I always say, I can never review palettes like on a first impression or um, just after, you know, one wear on my lids. Usually I like to test a palette for about a full week and I've just been so behind because it feels like Christmas just like snuck up on me and I am actually going on a little road trip um, over the weekend here coming up. Um, my one of my best friends is moving to California and I totally volunteered to drive with her So this is gonna be a crazy week But I thought I would try and film some of these swatch videos so I can get them up for you guys in case you're contemplating Purchasing some of these palettes. So this is what this guy looks like and let's get into some swatches Okay, you guys I'm sure you've already seen this palette reviewed and everything but in case you wanted my perspective Here's my little swatch video now. There's nine shades and honestly, when I saw promo pictures of this, I was like, what the heck are people going to do with this palette? But I just think it's such a fun, like, unique, out-of-the-box color combo. And it's kind of going to push you to think, like, hmm, what can I do with these colors? And right away, this middle shade is, like, calling my name. It's chocolate. We have tart. And then we have creme. Oh, my God. Look at that shade tart. Are you kidding me right now? It's got the most intense, like, duochrome vibe. Oh, I love that. Oh, my gosh. Okay, next we have Macaroons. We have the shade Custard, which, honestly, like, that color, Custard, and Puffs were, like, calling my name. This whole row is just, like, doesn't this, like, take you back to being a teenager and just, like, all things girly and awesome? Oh, God. I can't wait to put this palette on my freaking face. Are you kidding me? Look at how pigmented that pink swatch. And it's like a beautiful baby pink glitter shade. And now for the last row, we have some wonderful matte transition shades. There's this beautiful glitter called Mont Blanc. So we have Berry Mousse, Mont Blanc, and then Crepes, which you guys know Crepes would be like my go-to transition shade for my skin tone. Oh my gosh. This is so pretty. I would totally wear these shades with like a shirt like this. This is honestly stunning. Like, are you kidding me right now? I love this. I love when they do their little nine pan palettes because I feel like Juvia's Place is one of those brands like, I'm not like a color person, but Juvia's Place like makes me think like, could I be a color person? Could I do colorful eyeshadow looks? And the answer is, hell yeah, I can do colorful eyeshadow looks. And like this shade, oh my god, I can't wait to just like blend that into my crease because there's a color similar to this in the Queen of Hearts palette by Colored Rain. And this color just with my skin tone looks bomb in the crease. So I'm very, very excited for this new Juvia's Place palette. Let me know if you guys picked this one up. Leave me a comment down below and of course... If you did find this video useful or entertaining, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!